Hello, hello everyone. How you guys doing today? What's up? I'm Red and welcome back to a new episode of the Bingo Man profile. <laughs> I had to think there for a second. But uh, yeah, like I just said, today we are going to be doing some bingo. It literally just started about half an hour ago. So uh, we're going to go and create a profile real quick and start the grind. But before we start the grind, I just want to say, I don't think I included this in the last video or last bingo video rather. But I went ahead and actually upgraded our rank. So we are now bingo rank 4, which is the highest that we can go. And we currently have 53 more points. So what we're going to be working towards is the bingo talisman and maybe even the bingo ring. But I don't think we'll get enough points for that. But definitely for the bingo tally. So we currently have 53, like I just said. So we only need 50 more, which should be very doable. And uh, then we're going to start making our way to the bingo relic. And once we get the bingo relic, then I'm going to start buying some of the other things in the store as well. But uh, tally has the priority, obviously. So, without further ado, let's go and create our bingo profile. There we go, what are we starting with? We are starting with a personal deleter. Okay, let me unlock this slot. But an abaphone. Pretty. Ooh. <gasps> I love that. Personal compactor with three slots. Okay. Grappling hook and the five medium storages. All right. And if I'm not mistaken, if we make our way over here to Alexer, I think he should give us good potions now. So like haste three, I think. So we technically don't even need to get God splashes anymore or bingo splashes. So that's really good. I, I really like that. And apparently now also if you die, you don't lose potion effects anymore. I don't know if that applies to bingo or just normal skyblock. But uh, that's something that we will test, I guess. First though, as per usual, we're going to be punching some wheat and uh, get some levels up so that we can make our way all the way to the mushroom desert. And then uh, we also need some coins. So uh, this is going to be perfect. There we are. We just unlocked the farm suit armor. So let's go ahead and quickly craft it. Helmet. Chest plate leggings and boots there we go just so that we have uh, a little bit of uh, an armor set going and we also hit skyblock level 2 already beautiful we're getting so much xp at the start it's kind of crazy obtain 10 fairy souls obtain 12 unique pets all right so one of the first pets that we're gonna buy is actually the griffin pet from diana while well, she's still here let me talk to this farm merchant real quick and sell some of my stuff there we are, we have more than enough coins to actually afford the griffin, so let's go and do that real quick before I forget. So we now have two unique pets, if I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty sure bingo counts, right, yeah, okay. And then I'm gonna go ahead and actually get these fairy souls because, uh, well, they're kind of easy to get. There's plenty of them around the hub, so uh, might as well. And this should be our last one. There we go, our first bingo goal complete. That didn't take long at all. Beautiful. And then now we can make our way to the barn. Actually, just go to the mushroom desert straight away. And I think I'm going to get myself mushroom armor real quick. So another unique armor set real quick. There we go. Mushroom armor unlocked. Let's go ahead and craft it. There we are. We are looking drippy. And this is our second armor set. And now we can go back to the hub and actually get a golden axe and golden shovel. We're going to talk to the librarian to buy some XP bottles and I'm going to try and avoid as many NPCs as I can so that we could maybe try rolling for dedication four on the garden. So there we are. XP bottles. I'm just going to buy the max amount, I think, because we will need them. So I might as well. There we go. Efficiency five on our golden axe and efficiency five on our golden shovel as well. And we are now enchanting level five. We need 10 to be able to get the experimentational table. So right now I'm going to go back to the barn actually, or to the mushroom desert rather, and uh, get us to mining 12 so that we can get access to the dwarven mines. And then uh, we're also going to craft the sand minion once I have enough here. Alrighty, I just hit mining level 12, but for some reason it doesn't say that I gained access to the dwarven mines, which I'm kind of concerned about. I don't know. I, I swear it used to say it, but uh, now it doesn't. So I'm kind of confused. I don't know what's happening there, but let's uh, let's go ahead and actually craft up this minion as well. 
And uh, there we go, tier 6. Beautiful. Next up, we're gonna go and chop down some oak. We need quite a decent amount of oak collection, so I'm probably gonna get a minion for this. And we will also get redstone minions for the redstone collection and probably a fish minion as well. But uh, yeah, I want to get oak out of the way because we're going to trade oak through the trade menu to get coal and then to get the 30 enchanted for Dwarven Mines Axis. I actually just unlocked the leaflet armor as well. So what I'm going to do is actually go and buy some iron from the merchant over here. I think he sells it. Let's see. Do you sell iron? Yeah, you do. All right. And uh, we're going to craft shears real quick and then just go and shave some leaves off the tree. Why can I not craft that? There's an- okay, I put it the wrong way. I was gonna say, there is no way there's a requirement to craft shears. Like, that's a default Minecraft item. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that was just me being stupid. But, uh, we should get another armor set here. So that will put us at 3 out of 12, I think it was? Let's see. Helmet. Chestplate. Leggings. And boots. There we are. Let's take this off real quick. Put this on. Oop. There we are. And what are we sitting on? Uh, that's pets. Where is the... Yeah, 3 out of 12. Alright, beautiful. I need my wardrobe ASAP. I'm also gonna go ahead and start crafting up this oak minion. So one tier, two, and then we can't get him to three. So that will do for now and then we can always upgrade him later on. And then right now I'm gonna go and get myself an iron pickaxe and we're gonna make our way towards the coal mine. We need to get coal to... I think it's level 5 for the enchanted one. I'm not sure, but we need to unlock the enchanted coal recipe. And there we go, we got enchanted coal. So now we can go ahead and actually craft these up. We've got 6. And then if we grab the oak wood, we can go ahead and trade it for coal. There we go, I now have 30 enchanted coal, so I'm just here making my way all the way down to the obsidian sanctuary. It's always so scary coming down here and trying to make my way to Reese. I always feel like something's gonna kill me. Yes, 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 please let me through. Take it, take it, there we go. And then if we go to hub, and then back to deep caverns. Oh, please work, please, please, please. I'm always so scared that they're gonna patch this. So hopefully they didn't. Let's see. Boom. Okay, it works. Perfect. Beautiful. There we go. Our final one. And please take me before that zombie there kills me. Alrighty. Heart of the Mountain Tier 1 and Dwarven Mines Unlocked. Beautiful. Fetcher wants 20 yellow glass. Alright, let's get that for him real quick. Because we need to get 25,000 mithril powder anyway. So we might as well start with the Fetcher. He should give us some coins and some mithril powder. There we go, 20,000. Beautiful. And then I am also going to go and just do the commissions as well. So the dailies. And we're also going to do puzzler. Actually, on second thought, we are not going to do puzzler because he's one of the garden visitors. So I'm going to avoid him. And when we hand in commissions, I'm going to make sure to only hand them into the king because we don't want any of the emissaries to visit us either. The only person I think that we won't be able to avoid is Gwendolyn. So that's kind of unfortunate, but uh, it is what it is. So what do we need here? First event and a mithril miner. All right, so I need to go and actually buy the bandage pickaxe thing because uh, I kind of forgot to get it. There we go. I got myself the fractured mithril pickaxe and I am going to go ahead and start mining the mithril. I'm also gonna put my points into the mining speed and just use all the powder as well. So we're slightly faster. There we go. First commission done. Let's go and hand it in. There we go. Our second commission done. I got my two titanium. There we go. Another mining level. And we also reached Heart of the Mountain tier 2. And we reached Skyblock level 7. We get access to the bazaar. Beautiful. <laughs> it's not like we're gonna use it. And then for our final commission here, we need to mine 15 titanium ore. This is gonna be painful. I think this is our last titanium. Let's see. Yes, there we go. Our final commission done. I'm also gonna go ahead and craft the mithril minion just so that we get that out of the way as well. All right, next up, I'm actually gonna go and get some of the minions out of the way. So I'm gonna go and get us some redstone minions because we need 130,000 collection. 
So I think I'm gonna go and grind maybe like two or three tier four redstone minions. It sh honestly shouldn't take long at all. There we go. I think this should be enough for me to get my third minion to tier three. There we go. And then we're gonna go to the park and actually get the raider's axe. Donut over here is gonna help us and unlock the store for me and then I'm gonna do the same for her. So uh, thank you for that. <laughs> I uh, should have enough. I think it's 130,000 to buy it and I have over 200,000 so uh, we should be fine. There we are. Let's see how much money do I have. Oh yeah, <laughs> we have more than enough. Hello. There we go. The store is open. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And the reason why we needed a Raider's Axe is because one of the bingo goals says that we have to put, I think it was 10 enchantments on it. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. Put 10 enchantments on a Raider's Axe. So uh, there we go. We got it. I'm now going to go ahead and put a sharp on my Raider's Axe. Hopefully we can get it here. Gentle, fast, legendary, heroic, sharp. There we go. Beautiful. Alrighty. I'm also gonna go ahead and place down these redstone minions so that they can start producing some uh, redstone for us here. Next up, I'm actually gonna go and also do some fishing. We need to catch, I think it's 50 fish to get the fish minion. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna go and get that unlocked real quick because uh, we will need 300 clownfish collection and I am not fishing that by hand. All right, I got my fish minion down, so that's done. We are now working towards the clownfish collection. I think we need 300. Yeah, 300 of them. There we go. And I also reached combat level 5 earlier. I was just killing some zombies in the graveyard, so I got that out of the way. Right now, I'm just trying to find a runic zombie, and it is uh, not looking good for us. I'm actually going to try another bingo goal. I'm going to try and get our zombie slayer to tier 3 because uh, that's one of the bingo goals. So uh, yeah, I think uh, I'm just going to do it right now. Uh, I need to get my combat up anyway because we need combat 12 for the end. So I might as well grind zombies. There's the boss and we want tapped it. I don't know if I'll be able to kill a tier 2, but I want to try it. Oh my god, I just found a runic mob. There we go! Bingo gold done! And we're also close to spawning the Slayer in, so let's see if we can actually kill it. I didn't even realize that was a runic at first, I just hit him. And then I was like, oh, this is- we need this. Alright, come on. Can we do this? Let's see. Ooh. Down to 12,000 health. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh. He's doing quite a bit of damage. I stop whiffing maybe oh server lag okay we'd love to see it and we should be able to all right yeah we can beautiful Alrighty, so i'll continue doing tier twos until we get to zombie slayer or zombie level three i think that's what we need all right it is now actually the next day i uh <laughs> didn't grind much bingo yesterday but I'm about to spawn in my final boss, so after we do this, we should be reaching another goal. I also crafted myself a wand of healing, just so that I can actually survive these a bit easier, because, uh, yeah, they were they do quite a lot of damage without like a proper god splash, so uh, it was kind of necessary, especially because I was doing them during the day as well, so I don't get the buff from the mushroom armor. But uh, we made it work, so we are all good here now bro are you kidding me that is so stupid the boss can't be in the village well i'm sorry this is not the village this is still the graveyard that is actually so dumb all right well time to do it again all right well let's try this again hopefully this time the boss doesn't push me into the village please hello there we go. Thank god. That was- uh, we were getting kind of close to the village again. That was, uh, I don't know. I feel like they need to fix that border a little bit or at least fix the wall if not the actual, like, border of where the village starts. Anyway, we can now go ahead and call Maddox and once we claim this, we should reach another bingo goal. Yes, sir. There we go. Zombie Slayer level 3 and another bingo goal done. 
We are now sitting on four personal goals. Sorry, not too bad, not too bad. And with that being done, I think that is where we're gonna call today's episode for bingo. So in the next one, obviously we will continue grinding bingo and then we have a really cool event coming to Skyblock and uh, I will definitely be grinding it as well. And then uh, episode 100 is coming soon. So I hope you look forward to that as well. But until then, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, consider subscribing, maybe liking. Don't forget to join this down below and I hope you all have a good rest of your day, evening, morning, whatever it is. And I will see you in the next one. Bye!